Yo guys, welcome back to another video, and today I'm actually going to be showing you a new RP glitch that is actually currently working right now. Now, I wouldn't actually say it is new, it has been out for quite a while, but I'm just going to be showing you how to do this. I haven't actually got this method uploaded on my uh, channel yet, but because um, I thought a lot of you would already know this, but it turns out a lot of you don't, so I'm just going to be uploading it now, and hopefully does, this does help you out. And um, it is super easy, it's also solo, it doesn't really require anything, it just requires one thing, and that's a helicopter that um, shoots missiles but if you're a low level you can go around the map and try and find a buzzard and uh, do it that way but if you own a savage or something like that it's obviously better and this glitch will work quicker and you can also use this as an afk rp glitch as well but before we get into the video i'd just like to tell you about the giveaway that i am hosting so i'm hosting a um, five mil giveaway for everyone on uh, xbox one and um, ps4 I haven't got it for PC sadly yet, but I am going to be working on that for future giveaways. So this is only for the Xbox One and PS4 this giveaway. And um, all you have to do to enter is just one, make sure you are subscribed to me, uh, my channel. Um, two, make sure that you follow me on Instagram because this is how I actually am going to be contacting you through like, Instagram and stuff like that. And um, three, just make sure you comment your gamer tag on the console you're actually on. So then I, it's just easier for me to get in contact with you in case you haven't got Instagram. And just so that I have to know what console you're on and what your gamer tag is and stuff like that. But um, yeah, that's the giveaway. And then back to the glitch anyway. What you actually want to do is um, be in any session. It can be an invite only, it can be a solo, it can be a public, anything like that. As you can see here, I'm just in the public. It doesn't really change anything. And um, this glitch is actually on double money and double RP as well right now. So you do get um, more RP and stuff like that. So this is why I'm showing you this week while this mission and stuff is on double money and double RP. But like I say, this glitch is actually really easy and is best for any level really. It's like really efficient and stuff like that. And it can level you up quite quick. If you are low level as well, you'll get loads of levels from this. And um, so it's probably one of the best RP glitches working right now. It's also legit RP as well. So you can actually not get banned from this method at all because you're actually earning it legit. Like, legit like I say and um, yeah so that's that and uh, like I say it's solo as well so it's like super easy and you could just do it all day if you wanted but anyway what you want to do is actually press pause go to online go to jobs press play job go down to rockstar created go to missions and then keep scrolling down or scrolling up until you actually find the repo missions as you can see here and like I say um, oh no it's RV nearly there not RV uh, ready yet it's RV nearly there sorry that's the mission you want to start up as you can see, like I say, it's in double money and double RP. And um, this is the mission right here on the gameplay on the screen. So make sure you actually do this, uh, start this correct mission up. Otherwise, any other mission won't work. It has to be that one. But you don't need to do anything to unlock it. It's like a Rockstar created mission. So it's already like made. So don't, it's not like the casino missions where you have to unlock it. So you can start it super easy. Um, you actually want to do this job solo as well. Unless you're doing it with your mates. But if you do get in it with um, loads of randomers and you're not the host, just back out and actually find a job until you are host. It should be quite easy to host, and as you can see, I hit it first try. But because it is on double money and double RP, you might go into a job with people already playing. So just make sure you are hosting it solo, so uh, no one messes this up for you. And then once you're actually in the um, job, like the loading screen, all you want to do is just start the job up and wait for you to load in. And um, this glitch, as you'll, I'll explain better further in the video. But um, you will have to restart this at, um, at a certain point, sorry. So at a certain point of doing this, after a certain amount of time, you'll actually restart the job if you want to carry on. But I'll get into that later in the video. And uh, you don't actually have to go into settings. This is just me turning my radar and the map on, stuff like that, so I actually know where I'm going. And um, basically what you want to do is press the pause, and you'll see that you have to go to this location here. It says the Brickade. Um, it's near Sandy Shores. And you actually want to head up there, but first of all, what you want to do is actually call your helicopter. But as you can see here, you can't actually call the Pegasus for the helicopter. So you have to do it from your uh, interaction menu and on vehicles. If you don't know how to do that, you'll see it in the gameplay in a minute. So the Pegasus vehicles doesn't work. So if you don't own a hangar with your, your helicopter, it's just best going around the map to try and find one. But if you have got it, just go to vehicles and then go on to request personal vehicle, uh, personal aircraft, sorry. And then switch across until you find the helicopter. It has to have missiles on it though for this glitch to work. Now personally, I am doing it with a Savage because it's one of the fastest like helicopters that shoot missiles. Uh, what actually lock on. So that's why I'm going to be using a Savage. Then what you want to do is just go over to your helicopter and get in it. Now instead of actually driving up to the brickade where it says, 
uh, what you actually do, want to do is get into the helicopter and fly up to the um, brigade. And um, I'll show you where to land there in further in the video. It just makes it a lot quicker and obviously you are going to need the helicopter for it as well. So you've got to actually get up there in the helicopter. So once you call your helicopter and like I say, just go down and actually fetch it and get in it. And um, let's give it a couple of seconds. And I'm actually going to skip out the travel time just so it makes the video a lot shorter for you guys. So you're not stuck watching a long video, just so it's cut down and simple for you guys to understand and stuff like that. So um, what you want to do when you're actually in the helicopter is just go to the brickade, as you can see, like I say, right here. And it shouldn't take you that long to actually uh, make your way up here in a couple of minutes. But as you can see, now I've actually travelled here. What you want to do is land behind the brickade. So near this red container here, you just want to land where I landed. And you're actually going to want to jump onto the container and actually run to the brickade. Then once you're at the brickade here, what you want to do is just get in it and sit in it for a couple of seconds until you see the enemies on the map. So the red dots on the map appear. Once they've appeared, what you want to do is just jump out of the brickade and actually run back the way you came, jump onto this car, jump back onto the red container and go into the helicopter. <coughs> now actually when you're in the helicopter, what you're going to want to do is go to the little island, what's here, as you can see there. Um, I'll show you better on the map in a minute, I'm just going to wait until I get into the helicopter. Then, um, like I say, once you're in the helicopter, what you want to do is come to this little island, as you can see here on the map. And... Um, this is where like the glitch is actually going to happen. From here you can actually go AFK or you can sit and do this glitch. Um, I'll explain that better in the video in a minute though. And which one's probably best to do and stuff like that. But what you want to do is just make sure, like I say, your helicopter has actually got missiles on it will actually lock on. Because it needs that in order for this glitch to work. And all you actually want to do is land on this island here. But you've got to make sure you land it the way I land mine. So facing the right way. So you see where that circle is in front of you, like a um, roundabout type thing. What you want to do is just land here, so you're facing this road here. And as you can see on the map now, all the vehicles do actually start to spawn in this location in front of me. And what you want to do once you're here is just hold A, and now you'll see that a helicopter is just shooting missiles. And um, the vehicles actually keep spawning, and the rockets actually keep coming out of the helicopter and just keep blowing all these vehicles up. Now if you have something heavy, you can just put it on top of the A button and be on your controller. Then you can go AFK and the helicopter will actually just sit here and carry on shooting. Now because it's on double uh, money and double RP, you actually get 50 RP per kill. And there's two people in the car, so per each vehicle you actually get 100 RP. And as you can see, when quite a lot of them do spawn, you are gaining like lots of RP and like mad amount of RP. Especially if you just sit here, you're gaining a good couple of levels from doing this. Now the only problem with this is, it's different for different people. So what I mean by that is, the vehicles could stop spawning after 10 minutes for someone, but then someone else they could stop spawning for like 5 minutes. But if that happens, what you want to do is just uh, finish the mission, you can quit, up to you, but just make sure you're out of the mission, and you just want to restart the whole glitch again and come back to this location, you can keep doing it again. After a certain period of time as well, after blowing the cars up, you'll actually stop getting RP as well. Now if that happens, like I say, just do the same, restart the glitch, just quit the job, reload it, and uh, just restart what you're doing here. And you could do this all day if you wanted, and you'll probably go up like 30 levels, probably more than that. You actually get that much RP. Like I say, it's around 2,000 or something per minute. Uh, stupid how much RP you can actually get from this, especially just going AFK. Now I would actually take advantage of this while it is working, and while it's actually on double money and double RP. So you are getting the most RP you can from this mission. And um, this is all you want to do really, is just sit here, hold A, or put something on the A button so it's shooting. And um, all it's going to do is just keep blowing these cars up, and you'll see that you are getting RP. Now, if your level doesn't appear on top of the screen, where it's showing that the RP is going up, that doesn't matter, it still is counting, but it's just not coming up on the screen. Later on in the video, you'll actually see that the RP does start to come onto my level, and it shows you on the screen. As you can see here now, look, it is, um, it's just appeared on top of my screen, but all the RP you got before that does actually um, go into the RP level, so don't worry about it if it's not showing up. Now if you're actually worried that it's not showing up and it's not going to count, I think if you just kill a couple of people uh, and wait a minute and kill someone again, the RP level should then rise like that, so you can see, actually see how much um, RP and that you're making. But yeah, so this is this glitch for today, I hope this does help you all out. 
button. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe and don't forget to enter the giveaway.